All right, first of all, clean all of your instruments. I'm gonna use tweezers. Uh, I'm also using, well, don't throw away your old mini blinds because you can cut them up and make perfect labels for your plants. There's no need to waste. Let's reuse where we can. Uh, I'm gonna start with some tomatoes. Uh, all of my instruments are clean. I will use uh, just a marker and these to label. I use the tweezers to put them in the uh, soil. And these are my seeds. I put them in plastic bags. And then I put them inside this container and I keep them in the refrigerator. And that way they will keep literally for years. So you don't have to worry about having to buy every year. Because there's no way an average person is going to sow this many seeds in a year for tomatoes. I mean, there are let's see 6,000 seeds in this pack so you're not going to plant 6,000 tomatoes unless you're a commercial farmer so uh, that hint is very handy just make sure they are dry make sure they're sealed in their individual containers and then put it in a larger container and just put it in the fridge it'll last for a long long time all right let's let's start planting some stuff we're going to start with these, which these are Roma tomatoes, which are fantastic for sauces. Uh, really, really good. They have a great flavor. They're an Italian style tomato. And all I'm going to do is I will take my tweezers, I will grab a single seed, and I will insert it about a quarter of an inch deep in the soil. And by the way, uh, I'm using a mixture of peat moss and uh, perlite for this planting. Uh, and that's how I'm going to do it.
Now, when I, when I do plant these, I'll bring the temperature up to about 72 inside. And uh, that should be sufficient because we're looking for about a 60 degree soil temperature to make these germinate. And I think we're gonna be well beyond that if we leave the temperature 72 on the inside. Okay, so this is 12 days after the initial planting on these in these uh, containers. And all of them have come up except the peppers. And these are 10 days after planting in those containers. And those containers seem to be doing a little better than the open containers, but they will both work. Uh, we've got onions, lettuce, uh, and I have a peach tree coming up finally. I planted a peach seed and we got a peach tree. And these are yellow plums here. So that's a yellow plum. I've got two of those that I grew from seed. So we're, we're doing pretty good and uh, overall I think we're doing better with the uh, Tupperware type containers than we are with the standard uh, seed starting. Uh, they seem to be bigger, healthier, and they germinate quicker. So, there you go.